good everybody welcome to an epic my damn toys video today ladies and gentlemen we have a very special edition of the mdt battle royal it is time for the return you know it's been a few months now since the last one i can't even remember the last one i don't think we've done one in the year of 2020 i could be wrong about that but i'm pretty sure the last one was like january or february possibly it could have even been before the new year so i'm excited to get back into it i figured it is the month of october halloween is coming any day now we got a few days away coming up this weekend so i figured we got to bring it back with a strong horror action figure battle royal thrown in with some WWE superstars. They also have some zombies, some mutants. We got every horror icon represented in here. We are missing some, but we'll get them in there. You know, we got the remake Pennywise. We got the original Pennywise. Jason, Chucky, Freddy, Pinhead, Michael Myers, Leatherface. We even got the Fiend. We got Kane. We got Demon Finn Balor. We even have Jeff Hardy represented back there. Right, right, right there. We got a lot of guys represented. I think there's 25 total guys in this thing. We got some zombies like like I said before, and I'm excited to get into this, man. We even brought back the MDT Battle Royal Championship as well as the MDT Horror Championship. So you guys can take a look at the championships right here. You have the MDT Battle Royal Championship, and then you have the MDT Horror Championship. And today, they will be defended. Both of them will be on the line today. I feel like, what wasn't it Ricochet? I think Ricochet was our last champion. It was either Chad Gable or Ricochet. I'm pretty sure it was Ricochet, but since he hasn't defended the title, guys, I'm going to strip him of the championship. I think that's the second time the title's been vacated. So today we're going to dive into the horror action figure battle royal. I want to go over the ground rules real quick before we dive into it. So how we do the MDT battle royals is we got to do the two feet rule. So two feet touch the ground or the table and you are eliminated. Now if you fall off the table you're automatically eliminated. You don't get any retries Brad. If you fall off the table you hit the ground you are gone automatically. Doesn't matter what's touching. If any part of your body's touching you are gone. Now if you fall off and you hit the table you guys can see the gray color right here. If you hit the table, two feet must touch. So, so if two feet or the bottom of your pants cuffs touch, you will be gone. So guys like Pennywise, Michael Myers, Jason, guys like that that have long pants, sometimes their feet will be prevented from touching a lot of the time because their, their pants are molded a certain way and we don't want any favoritism or any BS like that. We want to make it fair for every competitor here today. So we are going to make it where the two, you know, the bottom of the pants cuffs rule and I'll explain that if we have an example of it. But let's shut the hell up and dive into it guys. What I usually do is just swipe them to the right and then we'll take a look at who's all eliminated and then we'll line them back up and redo it until we go all the way to the end where we crown a new champion and we're going to crown a new champion because ricochet's not here today and we got two championships on the line i think pennywise is a two-time champion i could be wrong about that we also have mutant brock lesnar back there who also has been a part of this thing and has won the regular mdt battle royal championship before but since there's no former champion i'm not going to insert anybody on the second swipe it's all full swipes guys so let's shut the hell up and dive into the official MDT Horror Action Figure Battle Royal of 2020. Let's crown our champions and this should be the beginning of these uh, Battle Royals coming back. So you guys should get ready for that. I know a lot of people have been waiting on it so let's shut the hell up and dive into it guys and let's get started with swipe number one. I want to get a good, you know what I'm saying, a good nice little smash over this way. I don't want any of them to fall off the front but if that happens, it happens and you're gone. I also have this damn lamp in my way so that's unfortunate. Ah, Christ. So I honestly don't think we had that many eliminations, guys. We go over here to the right. I, th I mean, look at what we got going on right here. How the hell do you even end up like this if you're Michael Myers? I mean, look at Michael Myers hanging off the edge here. I think we actually did have one elimination down there, and it is going to be Chucky. So Chucky actually is going to be eliminated. That's unfortunate for him. We didn't have a lot of eliminations in the ring, though. It looks like the... Uh, uh, I think his left foot is actually off the ground. Mutant Brock Lesnar over here. It looks like his left foot, you guys can see his heel is just off the ground. If we come to the forward here, I really can't tell if Michael's left foot is touching or not. It looks like it's touching, but Pennywise, you guys can see right here, his right foot is off the ground, so he will be safe. Jason's up in the air, so he's safe. Freddy's feet over here, actually. Freddy's feet over here, actually, are hanging off, so they can't be touching if they're hanging off. It does look like, it does look like Pinhead back here is touching. That's an extra Chucky that does not count, but this Pinhead will be gone. It looks like Freddy, all these guys are safe. It does look like the remake Pennywise, though. Remake Pennywise is gonna be... Oh, actually, his right foot's off the ground. Holy crap. Look how close. Look how close that is. His right heel could not be any closer to touching the ground, so that's insanity. And it does look like Kane is touching back there. So Kane and Pinhead and Chucky seem to be the only ones eliminated, so I guess I gotta stack these guys back up and let's run it back for swipe number two. 
All right, guys, coming up for swipe number two, we had four total eliminations, right? I forgot that Michael Myers fell off the front and he actually did touch. Uh, that was probably one of the craziest, like, eliminations ever because he fell off the front, but he didn't fall off. He fell, like, up under, which was absolutely insane. But I hate that Michael was eliminated. I, I low-key wanted him to win, but we don't rig shit around here, Brad. We, we see who the, who the real deal is. And we're getting ready for swipe number two. Lots of big names still in here. I don't want anybody to fall off the front, so I'm going to try and make it where everybody goes that way. Way, and I almost effed that up right there. So let's just shut up and dive into swipe number two. The lamps are getting in my damn way. I'm about to have a meltdown. But uh, let's just dive in here, guys, and see what we can get going for swipe number two and see if, uh, you know, I mean, everybody can be eliminated on this swipe. You never know with the MDT Battle Royal. So let's go ahead and dive in, guys, and go with swipe number two. Well, damn, Brad. We had two fall off the front this time. But holy crap, guys. The remake Pennywise is alive because he landed on the lamp. Freddy is gone, unfortunately. He is touching the floor. But the other Pennywise did not touch the floor. So he will be safe. Not a single part of his body is touching the floor. That is miraculous. That is a big time save right there. Holy crap, what a save. What, probably one of the best saves of all time. But Freddy Krueger, unfortunately, did bite the dust. We do have some other guys right here. It does look like both Pennywise will survive. Leatherface is eliminated. Both of his feet are touching right here, so Leatherface will be gone. It does look like Jason will survive. Pennywise will survive. Uh, coming up right here, it looks like Jeff is good. It looks like Little Sister from Bioshock is good. Tiffany is good. We're going to have to uncover some of this right here. Jason's good. Little uh, Michael Myers creator wrestler guy is good, making his first appearance here in the Battle Royal. It does look like, however, the theme Bray Wyatt is gone over there. Seth Rollins is safe. AJ Styles looks to be gone. The Mutant Brock Lesnar is gone. Sasha Banks is gone, or Zombie Sasha. It looks like Roy from Part 5 over here is gone. His feet are touching right there. So we had way more eliminations, it seems, in this round than the last one. Leatherface is to of note. Freddy Krueger is of note as he fell off the front there. So the horror icons are dropping off, but we still have plenty more to see if they can survive. So this guy's safe. Uh, this Stone Cold figure was safe. Undertaker looks to be safe. Shinsuke's safe. Jeff's safe. It looks like Asuka's zombie figure will be gone. These three are safe. So Fiend gone, Zombie Sasha, Zombie Asuka, Seth safe, Finn safe, Brock and AJ gone. And Roy. Don't forget about B.A. Roy over there. Just so you guys are wondering, that's not another Jason. That is part five Roy. But let's line it up for swipe number three. Alright guys, so for this next swipe, I went ahead and just lined everybody up. So we're down to the what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We're down to the final 12 here and I wanted to get everybody in a line. That way it's all even when I slap them like this and we'll see how this goes. But we got both Pennywise's. We got Jason in the house. We have Little Sister. We got Tiffany, Jeff Hardy, Finn Balor. Finn Balor's like a three or four time champion at this point. So, I don't know, man. He can slip up and win this thing, no doubt. Anyways, let's go ahead with the next swipe. I'm going to hit him like this again uh, because my full arm link can get it and we can knock them all out and let's see what we got. Oh, God in heaven. I think the Pennywise's flew a little bit further than I expected. Let's get a replay shot on that. So we did have a faculty, a faculty. We had a fatality off the front there in Stone Cold Steve Austin Zombie. We have this creator wrestler right here. It does look like he is both touching there. Uh, shit up the zombie figure. It does look like it is uh, biting the dust right there. Um, I think, good God, man, do we have anybody left right here? It looks like all these guys right here in this area, Undertaker, Little Sister's feet are touching right there. If we move her, uh, it does look like Tiffany is also touching. So Little Sister, Michael Myers, create a character guy, Shinsuke, Undertaker, Tiffany. It looks like Seth Rollins also is gone. Uh, oh my God in heaven. I didn't even notice this ish, but Finn Balor is torn in half, or his torso is like rotated, and he, is la he landed on top of the damn car over here. That's probably what that loud noise was and we got a stretcher knocked over over there um let's make sure it looks like both pennywises are safe as you guys can tell by their feet over there jeff hardy looks to be eliminated there we know finn balor's safe because he's obviously on top of the car over there and it looks like jason's leg is popping up right there in front of pennywise so i mean it looks like we're down to the final four man i'm excited to see if we can crown ourselves a brand new champion or if you know pennywise could possibly retain that championship and become a two-time horror champion or whatever i don't even know he may be a three time champion, but uh, let's line up our final four guys and see if we can finish up our battle royal. Alright guys, we are down to our final four. Now, are we going to crown a new champion on this swipe? We'll have to see. I do have my phone off to the side doing a 
slow-mo recording of the actual events that are taking place. Now, one thing we're going to do in this Final Four is I'm not going to do the two feet method because it's very hard to call. And, you know, first two feet touching versus who touches first. So what we're going to do is we're going to do last to touch. So what, how the Final Four usually works is we're just going to tap them. I'm going to get my hand right here and barely tap all four of them at the same time. That way they're all touched at the same time. And whoever hits the ground last will be the new MDT and Horror Champion. So we're going to literally just give them a tap and then whoever touches the ground last. So like it's going to be in super slow motion. It's the only way we're going to capture it. It's going to look like they all hit at the same time, but we should be able to go to the super speed slow-mo cam and see which one hit first and we'll see about that. But let's go ahead and tap them. You know, if it's a tie or if we, you know, it's inconclusive evidence, you know, we're going to go to the review. If it's inconclusive and we can't decide a champion based on the footage, we will run it back and we'll see if we can crown a new champion off the, you know, the people that are at question. So Finn Balor is in here. You just can't really see him on camera between Jason and the back Pennywise here. So I'm just going to hit him like this and I got my phone recording. Let's find out what the hell's going on and see if we can uh, decide who our champion is. I want to get an even hit here because I don't want any questions, man. I want it to be clear cut. So here we go. All right, that was super odd. Finn Balor, I know, landed like straight up. It was such a clean hit, but all four of them are touching here. Just for the record, let's go to the floor here. It does look like all four of them are touching. So it's not like all, you know, both feet didn't touch. All four of their feet have touched, or all four. Bottom of the pants cuffs are touching here, and the rest of them are on their toes touching. So it's not like we had some crazy controversial, you know, this guy's feet aren't even touching the ground. All four of them have touched. So let's go to the, let's go to the footage. We'll find out who the hell is our champion. Remember, it is the last person to touch. Not two feet, just touch, period. All right, guys, I think the I think the evidence is pretty clear. You guys can let me know what you think down in the comment section below. I'll slow it down for you guys. Not only will you see it right here, but I'll also do it in super duper slow-mo on the video so you guys can see exactly who touches last. But I think it's pretty cl clear cut and dry, and I'll let you guys know as soon as it plays right here and you guys can tell me. We'll do a couple replay shots so you guys can see it. So here they go. Can you guys tell exactly who touches last right here? Again, I think it's pretty obvious. One more replay. And you guys can see, Brad, that it looks to me like Jason Voorhees touches last, and that would mean that Jason Voorhees is our brand new MDT Battle Royal and Horror Champion. Congratulations to Voorhees. This is his first time ever winning the Horror Championship and his first time ever winning the Battle Royal Championship. Huge congratulations to that man. This is the Freddy vs. Jason version. I wish we had a Kane Hodder version, but you know what, Brad? We'll take it. Jason has never won here. One of my favorite horror icons of all time getting the win right here. I honestly, you you know, I thought Michael would get it, and I low-key was rooting for Michael, but Jason is the one that comes out on top. Huge congratulations to Voorhees for the epic performance in the Battle Royal. I thought for sure, I mean, he was going up against some of the best, man. Pennywise is a multi-time champion. Finn Balor is a multi-time champion. Uh, I think Remake Pennywise has even won the championship before, but today, baby, it was Voorhees day, baby. Before we get out of here, guys, I do want to give a huge shout-out to a commenter on our last video. So if you guys did not know, if you guys want a future shout-out in a future video, go ahead and leave a comment on this video. Leave a like, comment something down below for a, for a future shout out. So huge shout out to Actually Ashley 9 for this comment on our last video of our Hell in a Cell review. They said I swear I heard one of the Usos say fuck it during the Hell in a Cell and I think you're right Brad. I think I did hear Jay Uso say that but if you guys would like a shout out, huge shout out to Actually Ashley for that comment on our last video. Comment down below, leave us a like and subscribe to the channel for more epic horror, WWE and action figure videos. Who's excited for Voorhees to defend this champion Ship in a future video. I think I'm going to have a horror championship match soon, Brad. Let me know who you'd like to see square off with Jason for the horror championship. I feel like Pennywise needs to be in there since, you know, he, he was down here at the end. Maybe a triple threat match or something. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at my damn toy. Comment down below for a future shout out and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.